it's saying? It's saying chitty 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 Kyle Bahalio is kind of doing that to everyone, and we know Oleg Jaychuk as a guy at 185 with some serious power, but he probably could fight down at 170 if he wanted to cut a little bit of weight, maybe change the diet up. So he was definitely undersized going up to uh, against Kyle Bahalio, but we have seen him have success in this division. Wins and finishes over Sam Alvey, finished Cody Brundage, finished Shamil Gam Gamsatov, so a lot of pretty bad fighters, but finishes for Oleg Zaychuk nonetheless, and the only recent losses, again, are to Kyle Bahalio and to Dustin Jacoby before that. But he's taking on Chidi and Joe Kwani. And Joe Kwani is a guy who had many, many fights pre-UFC. Uh, he fought in TPF. He fought in Bellator. He fought in LFA. And ultimately earned his contract through Contender Series. But since he's been in the UFC, he's 2-2. Two and two, Came out blazing, right? Smoked my boy the power bar. Got an easy first round finish. Did the same thing to your boy, Dusko Todorovic, immediately afterwards. And... It was all great for Chidi and Joe Kwani, and then he ran into RoboCop, and it earned him fight of the night, but he was on the wrong end of the TKO. Got absolutely smoked in that one. If you remember, uh, Gregory Rodriguez got that third eye cut on his forehead, but nonetheless figured out a way to RoboCop a victory. And most recently we saw Chidi, uh, or in March of this year, and it was against Albert Duraev, and he lost his split decision, but it was a very close fight. So he's 2-2 two two in the UFC. Has lost two straight, though. So in this one, Meat Boy, are you going to take the longer, rangier, fast-punching Chidi and Joe Kawani, or is Misha Oluk our Polish brother, going to sleep him with one of those overhead bombs? Who you got? Honestly, you can never underestimate the Polish power. Um, most likely, he sleeps him. Chidi did get slept pretty bad. Um, but I don't know. I like Bang Bang, and I think Bang Bang is going to send... Hussar into another dimension. Uh, I think the speed will be there, the strength will be there. It's just his jaws a little suspect, so I think that's why uh, he is the slight dog. But I think in a normal world where you know he didn't just get destroyed two times badly, um, I think people would more likely pick Chitty. But I don't know. This one's really a pick. Em. Makes sense with these odds, but I, I like Chitty in this. He's slightly plus, and I got high hopes for him. Yeah, it's essentially a pick 'em, right? You touched on the odds, plus 100 for Chidi and Jokowani. The slight favorite is minus 120, Michel Oleg Zaychuk. But you'll also notice Hassar, aka Oleg Zaychuk, is six years younger, but Chidi and Jokowani is going to have a significant reach advantage in this one and will be the much taller guy. So there's a lot of brown from Tapology, right? 44% rolling with Bang Bang, 56% a slight majority rolling with Oleg Zaychuk. Do you think that this fight ends via a KO for either guy and. Do you anticipate it being early and often, or does this perhaps go longer than expected? Um, I think this is going to end early and often. If it goes, if it goes the distance, that will actually really surprise me. I'm kind of there with Tapology, Majority KO. One of these guys are going to bed. Uh, they are going uh, to bed with Aljamain Sterling, and. Uh, yeah, I don't know. This will be interesting. I'm, I'm not sure if it's going to end the first, second, third. I could see it going to the third and then someone getting knocked out, but it's going to be fireworks. I'm really excited to see it. This was going to be a crazy fight. Yeah, there should be fireworks, whether it lasts all 15 minutes or simply goes for 15 seconds. It should be a banger nonetheless. I've kind of been going back and forth. Uh, I wouldn't say I'm too, too confident in either guy just because they're so volatile. Both can knock you out, but both can also get knocked out. I think for Meat Boy's sake, though, I'm going to go with Oleg Jaychuk. Uh, I just, perhaps he's able to get on the inside, land some of those heavy strikes, and as long as he doesn't get slept by those rangy meat bombs that Chitty Bang Bang will be offering, perhaps Oleg Jaychuk will actually have the uh, advantage on the feet, and I don't anticipate there being too, too much grappling in this one. Chitty is obviously coming to Bang Bang, like his nickname implies, and Oleg Jaychuk's here to do the same. So if both guys meet in the middle and it's go, uh, go strike for strike, I'm going to take Oleg Zaychuk to get this one done, but definitely a uh, not very confident pick. Going to inspect the props, maybe find some juicy value there, but Oleg Zaychuk, low confidence. Any other, uh, any other thoughts? No, uh, to totally understand. Throw in the comments who you're taking and why. Make sure to smash that subscribe.